Alright, so that was the only one of those optional dungeons I really needed to do. But since we've, you know, already done three of them, we may as well do the last one. They're not very long dungeons, so why not? For the sake of completion, let's do this. Am I anywhere close? I am south of it. It would be much easier to just fly there. I don't know what I'm doing underwater. I believe it's right here. Indeed. Let's use our free submarine heal. Let's see what this dungeon has in store for us. Oh, these look familiar. Are any of you undead? Nope. And I'm getting out of here. I can also get rid of the reflect rings now. It's unnecessary. Elven mantle. Kaiser knuckles. <clears throat> Elven mantle. And Elven mantle. Really love that evade chance, as Lena demonstrated earlier in the Fork Tower. Yeah, rather not fight these. Or at least I don't want to waste my time. Hello. Oh. I was, ex I was expecting a little more out of that. It's Meteor just for fun. Yeah, look at all that damage. Okay, let's drop a save. And head into the final of the optional tablet dungeons. And here are our buddies, the gargoyles. Not falling for this trick again. Alright, gargoyles, let's do this. You know what, gargoyles? It's meteor time. <laughs> that makes me happier than anything you could imagine right now. Just destroying those annoying gargoyles. Alright, into the dungeon. What else is here? Uh, oh, there's some loot. Ooh, there's some loot. Turtle shell, not particularly great. Nope, you look like Zephyrus, I'm out. Alright, I guess I'll stay since I wasted a meteor. I'm at least gonna... get the get the experience for that. Alright, fair enough with that. It's not nearly as annoying as Everest was. Take that ether. Is there anything else up there? Go run. Oh, that that became a dragon. Um Curse you red dragon. Okay, red dragon not nearly as dangerous as it used to be. Oh, well, that was a waste of time. Get everybody healed back up here. Hmm. 
anything I can do up here? No, it doesn't look like there's anything there. Over here, perhaps? Yes. Yes. Oh, that's a tonberry. I know what tonberries do. I'm not getting stabbed. If you're not familiar with Final Fantasy, tonberries tend to shank people. I'd rather not have that happen. For obvious reasons. A little bit of a split path here. No, thank you. Nope. Definitely don't want to fight a Ghidra. Alright, you know what? I guess we're going to fight a Ghidra. Screw you, Ghidra. Okay, Ghidra's a joke now. And everybody's poisoned, aren't they? Of course. And I don't have a whole lot of antidotes. Okay, that chest up there, I can't get. You need a thief. For the sprint ability. You hit the button, it turns off the water, you sprint over and grab the chest. I'm My party's not fast enough to make it. So there's no point even trying. So here, we just work our way around and collect some items. Phoenix down, sure, why not? Get away from that. Hey, Reflect Ring! Sure wish we had more of those. Alright, so now, head on down, save point, that's pretty convenient. Not going to use it just yet. I'm going to take care of some business in this room first. Well, I didn't intend to come down here. Okay, so you got to be careful with these chests because they're trapped. These crystals that come up do a lot of damage. Thankfully, hitting the button reveals them. Alright, so none of that's particularly useful to me. But that's how you get all of it. Get on out of here. No reason to fight the snail. Some more loot up here. Artemis Bow. Good to know if you have a ranger and haven't picked up your ultimate weapon yet. There is a trap right there. Right on that square I'm facing. I'm purposely avoiding that. For the moment, at least. Got an enhancer. Let's take a look at that, as that sounds kind of useful. It is a sword. That increases magical power. So really nice for Mystic Knights, Red, and Blue Mages. Not useful for my party, however. One more chest to acquire right here. 12,000 gil? Sure, why not? Now we're going to head back to that save point. No Tonberry. Not dealing with your shenanigans. Alright, so cottage up. Let's go ahead and learn Golem. No need to leave him sitting in the inventory. Alright, drop a save. Because you know it's got to be getting close to boss time. 
Now, this dungeon was actually kind of confusing in my casual playthrough, because it took me forever to figure this out. But, the actual solution to progressing is to get rid of those spikes, and then fall down the hole. And there is the last tablet. Let's go grab it, shall we? Hey, fourth tablet. We grabbed that without even a fight. Oh, here we go. So what have you got up your sleeve for us? Wait, what? Oh. Hello, Leviathan. What you doing here? Oh, you want to kill the boss for me? That's cool. Okay, so this is Leviathan. One of the strongest summons in the game. If you'd like to acquire him, all you have to do is talk to him. I don't have a summoner, so I'm not going to bother. As he is actually completely optional, meaning this dungeon actually does not have a required boss. But if you do want to get Leviathan, uh, the easiest strategy is to go buy four coral rings, the ones that absorb water, and you're basically invincible against him. So... See ya. Yeah, let's work our way back to our ship and we can go acquire all the other legendary weapons that we don't need. Because... Completionism. I say that having just willingly walked away from a boss. A boss that I do not have the required tools to beat. You either need four coral rings or a lot of lightning damage. I do not have either of those things, so... I'm moving on. Let's go get those weapons. Sealed Castle should be over this way. I believe we passed it. Um, almost. I think. There it is. Okay, you guys need to really get out of my way. Nope, not dealing with Exodus Soul. Bye. Shield Dragon, no. Alright, good. That was rougher than it should be. It's healed parts. Can't have him laying around on the job like that. For such a short run, that's very dangerous. Alright, so let's just start grabbing stuff. Masa Moon? Sure. It's fancy. Runax? Sure, I'll take that too. Can I get another Holy Lance? No. Sasuke's Katana? Sure. I'll take Sasuke's Katana. Assassin Dagger? Sure thing. I guess I can technically equip that one. Oh, I need to place another tablet, don't I? Alright. Where were we? Give me my Assassin Dagger. And this one? 
Excalibur. The real Excalibur. Uh, I believe I already got this one, didn't I? No? Oh, it's the Gaia Bell. Sure. Take the Gaia Bell. For some reason I was thinking that was one of the staves. Alright, let's go ahead and put the other tablet up. And grab the remaining weapons. Yoichi's bow? Sure thing. Fire Lash? Yep. It's mine now. Sage's staff? Indeed. I will take all of these things. I believe that is all 12 of them now. Okay, onward. To glory. I don't believe there's anything left but to head to the final area now. It's exciting. Oh. Wait, now there's an earthquake? Hey, you can't blame us this time. We weren't down south. Okay, maybe there is something else we can do other than head to the last area. I guess we'll have to have a look next time. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time with more Fiesta.